Well, this is just ominous. Is there like a big grand sound to it like Elden Ring or Dark Souls? It's just this dark, dingy, brooding sound. This is going to be a pretty difficult game, isn't it? All right, what's going on, guys? It's Jeff, and finally, after I, I don't even know how many years, I am here on Bloodborne. Bloodborne is a Souls-like... If you've never heard of Bloodborne, uh, well, I'm, first of all, I'm sorry. I have heard about this game, and I haven't even played it myself. Elden Ring is one of the biggest games on my channel, and as somebody who has made a lot of Souls content, especially recently, ever since Elden Ring, I did a little bit of Dark Souls beforehand, some Sekiro in there. I have never played Bloodborne. I added as a little part of my video yesterday to get over 20,000 likes if they wanted me to uh, just even try some Bloodborne. And we'll see where we go from there, depending on the feedback on this video. So I know whether or not people actually genuinely want it. It had over 20,000 likes in like five hours. So new game. Oh, yeah. I don't know anything about the lore. Pale blood. Pale blood. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. I didn't make Yarnum those. is the home of blood ministration. Yarnum. You need only unravel its mystery. But where's an outsider like yourself to begin? Easy, with a bit of yarn and blood of your own. But first, you'll need a contract. Is this Millennia's uncle? Oh my goodness, the graphics! <laughs> Alright, I, listen, hey, I know that this game isn't known for graphic fidelity and whatever, but hey, if and when that remake happens, it's inevitable, it has to at some time. The environments, uh, the screenshots I've seen, Here's the thing, overall absolute doom and gloom of Bloodborne is super interesting to me. Like the whole gothic castles and aliens in the sky, almost Lovecraftian-like stuff. I think the aesthetic of this game is one of, if not the coolest in the entire Souls series, Elden Ring included. Everything is just absolute doom and gloom. And that's not to say that there's no beautiful horizons out there, but it's a beautiful horizon of chaos. I'm gonna go with military veteran. It seems like it's got the best stats here. Now, I did look at a couple things about the game, like the controls and stuff because I couldn't find it in the options for whatever reason. Uh, and the controls are even kind of weird. So I'm really worried that I'm going to end up uh, pressing the wrong buttons when I should. It's just going to be a weird thing. So I looked it up. I think I got it figured out. I just didn't want to end up hating the game immediately due to my own uh, stupid assness. All right, this is the closest that they got. Some kind of wavy-ish hair. It's not exactly curly, but whatever. All right, let's go. Antidote. Small medicinal tablets that counteract poison. I'm probably never going to use that. Although I did hear that uh, a lot of items in this game are especially useful. Good. Oh. All signed and sealed. Now, did I even have a choice? Transfusion. Oh, he hasn't oh, even done it to us yet. So we woke up on an Whatever operating happens. table. You may think it all a mere bad dream. Why is he laughing? We would be dead without him doing this, right? So, I mean, it kind of helped us. I don't know why it makes it seem like he's really that evil. Why even do this to us? I'm asking lore questions about a From Software game. What the fuck? It's a fucking werewolf. Or just a wolf in general. What are you doing? Did, did we do that? What the fuck is going on? Okay, now we got like these weird alien zombies or undead or some shit. I don't know. Babies? What the fuck? Ah, you found yourself a hunter. Everyone is finding me except myself. Oh, we're in. We're finally in. Holy shit. Okay, all right. This is, uh, Bloodborne. I already like the aesthetic. They already give us a hood. That's what I'm talking about. So we, uh, we got this. We got a roll. View notes. Right hand. Attack with this. Okay, we have no weapon, though. Okay, it's the same controls this way. Uh, what's this do? Okay, left punch. Oh, that two hands. Oh, that's so weird. Usually triangle is a two hand. Wait, no, triangle is a two-hand on Dark Souls. What's the two-hand again over on Elden Ring? L1 triangle? Uh, okay. Oh, all right. Uh, I don't have a weapon. Did I miss it? Okay, uh, apparently I didn't miss a weapon. I guess I'm not supposed to have one. Wait, I don't do any damage. Oh, shit. Wait, what is that dodge? Okay, wait, I'm just gonna run. Blood vial. That's a heal. Open door. 
I don't think I can beat that. I mean, you could probably do it. It's it's a Souls game. You probably can beat it. The first boss or whatever, usually like unbeatable. Although, I mean, a half damaged just... Oh, quick silver bullets. Too bad I don't have anything to shoot it with. I really hope I didn't miss an item back there and uh, everyone's just screaming at me right now. I mean, feel free to backseat. I'm probably not going to read it, though. There's a ladder over there. Oh, he doesn't take any damage either. Away? Wait, you away? You came to me. Operate. Oh, it's bringing the ladder down. Hold on, let me grab these items. Up the ladder. Go. Oh, no, they can follow. Oh, shit. I'm just going to keep running. Maybe I shouldn't? I oh, bonfire thing? Grab it. Sit. Sit. Transports. Return to Hunter's Dream. I don't know what that means, but go. Oh, I don't know how invulnerable you are during that. So we're in the Hunter's Dream. So we became a hunter? Now the guy gave us some blood. I have no idea what's going on. I guess it's meant to be that way right now. Until we get a better explanation. See, even just that architecture is fucking beautiful. It's like sad, but look how beautiful that shit is. It's horrifyingly pretty. Trade in blood echoes with messengers to buy and sell items or weapons. Yarn and hunter stuff. Ooh. Okay, so they got armor and stuff over here. No weapons, though. What is that? An abandoned doll. Yarnum headstone. Oh, okay, so you uh, end up spawning back with this thing. Uh, okay, no. Accept gift from messengers. Is this an online thing, or...? Oh, shit, wait, they give you the weapons here. So, saw cleaver, hunter axe, or a threaded cane. I saw people uh, talking about how you want to get the items that give you, like, beast damage or something. I, I think that that thing over on the bottom means beast damage, right? So, I'm going to go with this saw cleaver. I see a bunch of people use it. I can't imagine it's too bad. Another gift. We can get a... Okay, a hunter pistol and a blunderbuss. I'm going to get the pistol as well. I'm going to go lightweight for now because I, I don't really know what I'm doing. Keep a gift, another gift, a notebook received. Notebook, okay. Uh, messengers are inhabitants of the dream who revere brave hunters. Use them to send messages to other worlds. Okay, cool. So I put saw cleaver on here. Okay, so wait, the pistol has to go over on this hand. Okay, I got it. I can take the pistol away, put the pistol back. Two, three, four, five. Oh, wow. Okay, this is actually really good at attacking. Whoa, wait, how did I do that? L1. It changes it into a different weapon. Oh, shit. Oh, here's that old guy that did this shit to us, right? Oh, no, it's not. Aha. Uh -huh. You must be the new hunter. I guess. Welcome Are there a lot to of us? the hunter's dream. This will be your home. Okay, thanks. I am... Gehrman. Gehrman. I don't want to talk about spoilers or anything, but I do know the boss's name, and that name sounds a little familiar. This was once a safe haven for hunters. It's not safe right now? We don't have as many tools as we once did, but you're welcome to use whatever you find. Alright, cool. At the top, should it please you. What the fuck does he mean by that? Is there a jump button in this game? Oh, I just healed. Fuck. Wait, can we go back and kill that thing? Hold on. Going back to the sick room real quick? That means I have to go all the way back. I didn't go that far, and I can just kill all of them anyway. Now we're gonna absolutely shit on this thing. Remember me? Yeah. Three blood vials. Okay, you can already hold ten of them? How many can you hold in total? Now I can kill these guys that were chasing me. It's weird. They sound like scared of me, but like not completely mindless. The one guy was screaming, get away. Like he was scared of me. Why? All right, they're all dead now. I can't go through that gate, so I have to go up here. And the thing is right... Okay, yeah, we made it right back really quickly anyway. Wait, I can hear somebody over here. Talk. Oh, you must be a hunter. And not one from around here either. I'm Gilbert, a fellow outsider. You must have had a fine time of it. Yarnum has a special way of treating guests. Okay. Well, I don't think I could stand if I wanted to, but I'm willing to help if there's anything that can be done. All right, I'll remember <laughs> this that. This town is cursed. Oh. Whatever your reasons might be, you should plan a swift exit. Uh, don't mind if Whatever I do this. Whatever you gained from this place, it will do more harm than good. Now, when they remaster this shit, these landscapes are gonna go crazy. Look at this shit! It is absolute misery, and it's fucking beautiful. It's a weird thing to say, but it, that's how it is. So, like, if I swap it to this. It's got more reach. It feels safer somehow, but it hits a little bit not as hard. So, I heard that there's actually a mechanic 
where when you get hit in this game oh wait a lever look now i don't have to worry about going through that again that's what i'm hearing stomp around so apparently there's a mechanic in this game where whenever you get hit it kind of works like gray health where you can actually recover whatever amount of damage you took within a period of time if you end up doing damage back to an enemy so the game does encourage and reward aggressiveness not necessarily the same as Sekiro, but it definitely wants you to fight I didn't get it in time. Oh, fuck! Okay, wait a minute. What the fuck is that? I stunned them. I think you can stun them when they're like in the middle of attacking. I've seen videos of people do it before, so I, I assume it works like that. Okay, let's try again. We only have eight more bullets, though. How do we get more bullets? Got it! Ugh! No. Got him. Holy shit. Wait, the dodging is so weird in this game. He only gave blood vials. That's crazy. It's like when you're locking on, your character doesn't just like do the iframe roll that like all the other Souls games have. It doesn't always do this roll right here. Your character does like this sidestep thing. Oh, that's really weird and different. I'm not used to that. Uh, knock? Hello? Are you that outsider? I hear some oh, ladies sorry, screaming inside. What's going on? to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Blood vial? All right, yeah. I like how you just basically keep healing. That's your come on. You don't open the door on the night of the hunt. Oh, the hunt. You now. So I'm a hunter. It's the night of the hunt. And they just infected me tonight for a hunter. Are there other hunters? Besides Garman? Oh, wait. What is this guy sitting here for? I don't want to aggro all of them. Just some of them. Oh, never mind. Bring them all. Fuck it. Fuck it, bring them all. Yeah, oh, this weapon is insane. Is it the weapon or is that just how the Earth game is right now? What's happened to all these people's faces? Are they all turning into werewolves or what? Okay, so I think these little red things, I keep thinking they're items and then I can talk to people. I don't reckon you're from around here. No. Well, stuck outside on a night of the hunt. Okay. How oh, you poor, poor thing. Why don't we just go to sleep for the night? <laughs> They just laughed at us. That's crazy. I mean, have fun sitting inside, pussies. Who would do that? I'm gonna kill whatever this big ass thing is growling and screaming over here. Oh, fuck! Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna lie, that feels real good. Oh, shit. I'm liking it. I'm fucking with it. I don't even know, like, what kind of century this is based off of with, like, the, the style and the architecture and all these, like, buggies and shit. Cold blood do. What, what is that? Oh, you get... Okay, so they're like little souls. Got it. Okay, so it's like a strength build on this game actually viable? Is there anything that's actually cheese like an Elden Ring or what? Do I want to do that? Is everyone going to be mad at me or what? It looks like I can hold up to 20 vials. Bullets I'm going to assume are the same? What the fuck was that? Earn that covers target in oil when thrown. So should I use this on everything that I'm going to throw a cocktail at? Will the cocktail burn longer, do more damage, or what? I'll test it out. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run past it. Nah, I'm good. The aggro doesn't seem too bad. I'm just gonna keep running. I'm running past all these guys, too. Oh, wait, they don't even chase me over here. They just all look at me. Look how crazy this shit looks. I do enjoy that the uh, aggro ranges aren't that bad. All right, cool. Why do they stop there, though? Uh, I mean... It's because it's a boss arena! Ow! I didn't even start fighting it because I was too busy just trying to throw stupid shit at it. Okay, hold on. Do I have to run all the way back through all of that? Why did I spawn here? Is the doll alive? Hello, good hunter. What? I Ronnie? am a doll here in this dream to look after you. Your name is just Doll. Honorable hunter, pursue the echoes of blood. Oh, it allows me to level up here. I mean, that's nice. Uh, here's the thing. I just died. Surely we could beat it this time. I don't know the move set. I don't... It's really weird as well to, like, dodge in this game. I, I cannot stress it enough how different the dodging is. Was there another, uh, thing here that I could get? Ringing old hunter bell. I didn't want to do that. Resonates with another. No, no, no. By the bell's resonance. I don't care. I don't know. Go through this. Cleric beast.
here again! Dodge! Fire again! In the ass! And he's dead! He blindsided me! Sword Hunter badge. It was raining blood. Oh, that's so fucking edgy. It's awesome. Badge of the Swordsman Hunters under Church's Blessing. I don't know what that means. We got 4,000 points. Oh, we can get our old echoes back. I forgot about that. We can go back and level up, right? So what do you want to level up in this game? Oh, shit! Uh, it's starting to rotate now. I don't even remember the 30 FPS. Said I wasn't even going to mention it. I haven't even been trying to fight against it. I just missed an item right there. Where's the doll at? Oh, Found her. Welcome home. I thought she was what gone. You desire? More HP, more endurance, strength, skill, blood tinge, arcane. So we can level up five times. What do I want to get? Um, Honestly, my damage seems fine. I'm just going to go all vitality. That'll be a good healthy amount right off rip. Oh, I can actually pop some of those blood thingies. Hold on. May you find your worth in the waking world. I like the message. All right, let's use these two. Oh. I didn't expect that Welcome. animation. We got good vitality. Let's just go uh, some more strength. And it gives you physical defense as well. Wow. Okay. So how much do I need total in order to buy this whole uh, Yarnum Hunter set? Like 2,500? I'll worry about that next time. Hey, I'm actually enjoying it a lot more than uh, I, I was really scared. I was going to hate doing and dealing with like all of that. But it just all immediately kind of disappeared. Again, obviously, I want this game to be in 60 FPS and completely remastered. I'm not saying 30 FPS is good. I'm just saying it kind of melted away as I was playing. That's all. So yeah, again, if you guys want some more Bloodborne, if you guys want a part two, if you want to see me start playing through the game and fight more bosses and stuff, let me know down in the comment section what I should be looking for, if I'm doing anything wrong or whatever. And uh, yeah, it's been Jeb, guys. Later.